All right, so you have commandos, and if you try to run it, you get this error, which says DirectX 5 not found. I cannot find DirectX 5. To solve that, right-click commandos, rename, and add an M so that it says commandos. Let's make it uppercase just so it's easier to see. All right, let's run it, and it works, and we can change the resolution to something higher. It is full screen for me, so this is what it looks like for me on the screen, but this is how OBS records it. But the problem is, we cannot load games. No. Let me skip that. And everything is super fast, like these guys move way too fast, which is nice from the f for the frame rate, but it's very hard to play. Okay. I mean, this easy coming. mission can be coming done, over. but it's hard. I'm coming. And I cannot save, and Control s doesn't work for saving. So let's quit. And let's fix that. We need a patch, the X64 fix. Let's download that. Uh, no, only once is enough. Let's um, keep this. And let's copy it to the commandos folder. And now let's uh, rename this to commandos back and then rename this one to C-O-M-M, -M, and those, and run it. Okay, so you can see the blinking is not that crazy, and I can go to load game. Let's start a game and skip through the Welcome. intros. Okay, and we can see the game is slower, the frame rate sucks, which is sad, but at least it makes the game more playable. Okay. So now it is much easier to play. Come on. No, it is actually playable. All right, uh, but as you can Coming see, the resolution over. is not great. It's still uh, one of these standard 4x3 resolutions. So now let's fix that. And for that, we will need another tool. And that one has a home page. I will link to that in the description as well. You have to scroll down. And here you can download it. Download the application here. And open it up. And we're going to just copy and drag this into the folder again. And now run it. Run anyway. And we're going to pick the commandos with double M. And then yes, extract, because why not? I think that, that makes something faster. And then there's things to do. We have to, we have to make it compatible with Windows XP SP3. So let's right click that. Properties, compatibility run in compatibility mode for Windows XP Source Pack 3. And we have to make sure that disable scaling on high DPU settings is checked. In recent versions of Windows 10, this is called in change high DPU settings. It's override high DPU scaling behavior and scaling performed by application. That's how you do it here. Let's see if that does anything. And now we can apply and run. And yeah admin rights. Oh yeah, I forgot. That's on me. So in this resolution hack, picking again this exe, I have to actually set the resolution I want, and I want 920 by 1080. Apply and run. And it confirms that the settings are disabled for uh, scaling stuff. And yeah, let's start a new game. It's June the 4th, 1940. The evacuation of Allied troops from Dunkirk has ended. Heavy human and material losses have been sustained. All right. Norway, February 1941. Gonna just skip that. Welcome to Norway, officer. All right, we can see these weird let's glitches on the right. That just happens, I, I guess. Relay station in this small but let me press escape. And when we zoom in, it goes away and zoom out. Uh, if we zoom out too much, it becomes weird. So don't zoom out too much. It's just a thing. It's just a thing of uh, maps that are too narrow, like this one. But apart from that, mm -hmm. okay, everything is nice and playable. Coming, sir. Yes, sir. Coming right over, sir. Coming, sir. Coming right over, sir. Coming over. I'm coming. Coming. I'm coming. Okay. 
That's easy. Coming over. I'm coming. Coming. Anyways, this is how you play commandos on a modern system with high resolution and not insane speeds. Hope you have fun with this old classic that is very weird to play nowadays. Maybe check out War Mongrels instead. And I will see you next time. Ciao.